We are going to get five yes no answers for you today along with some symbols, signs, numbers, and letters. Okay, so get your questions ready. Either one or all five, of course, as always. Hello and welcome to Falling Star Tarot. If you like weekly pick a card ratings, hit that bell, see my notifications each week, and of course subscribe to catch me again. Okay? So if you want to choose a pile between one and five or use our quick oracle to help, that's also fine. We will put the timestamps down below in the description box and the top comment for your reading. This time we're going to consult the wooden charms, yes, no. So get your yes, no questions ready. And we're also going to try to get you some symbols and clues from our tiles for the week. I would love to take this opportunity to thank everyone who has been supporting the channel. Keep your questions, comments, and suggestions coming because I am going to be creating those readings. I have a list, but I want your suggestions on that list, okay? And if you want to continue to support the channel, it's as easy as liking, subscribing. All of it means something to you seeing my videos ultimately and there are also links down below to where you can get something for yourself if you wish and support the channel as well. Okay, I will see you there. Hello, number one. First, I want to get your charms ready for you for the week. So you have a chance to kind of make something out of them, and then we will get your yes-no answer. So, what are the charms for this week for choice number one? There's quite a few. Let's see if I can get some of these out for you. It's like a Taurus. A cancer sign. So someone born on a sign of cancer. 7410. Oh, 44. Of a 9. Aquarius. Maybe some temperance is in order for this week. We have 2, 6, and 7. So there's 77. A six is all about beauty, um, breaking cycles. Not a lot of letters, but I'm sure you can make something out of those. I see door immediately. Roof. Let's make sure those are in the shot. And there's also a T and an L, of course. Okay. LT. All right. Um, and with those in mind, 77 is all about mastering, 44 is about being on a stable foundation, um, something physical. So maybe seeing those uh, physical manifestations we've been waiting for. You are welcome to look those two numbers up. You never know what kind of special message you might get. Your yes or no answer. Are you ready, number one? Pause the video. If you do not have a question in mind already, your yes or no answer for the week is a yes. Okay, I hope that's a happy answer for you. And I'm going to go on to pile number two. Okay, option number two, I want to go ahead and get out your charms for the week. Now these could be initials, symbols, zodiac signs. Um, and, of course, numbers that will mean something to you this week. Oh, we got spirit. Yes, we do. So if you have a spiritual practice or something like that, if you're into meditating, that could be a sign that that is going to be very important for you this week. We have Virgo energy. So some practicality, maybe sticking home and 
you know, do is some learning, focusing on your more uh, spiritual pursuits. Because Virgo, to me, is kind of the guru. So that's kind of interesting. It's almost like spirit came out twice. And I see 77 was um, there in the first reading as well. 14, we got a lot more letters this time. Look at all of those letters. I bet you can make some great stuff. I see sun, so that could be an abundance, um, happiness, everything being out in the open. Um, definitely a very successful week ahead. There was something that you were thinking, you know, should I put some more time and effort into this? Yeah, yeah, hit the books on that. Okay. And your yes or no answer for choice number two. Pause the video if you must. What is your yes or no answer this week, number two? It is a no. I hope that is a happy no for you. Remember that your future is in your hands and you can change it any way you like. Okay, I am going to move on to number three. Hello, number three. We are going to get your uh, symbols, signs, and numbers out first and let you have at those. This one really wanted to come out. We have a six. So that is about beauty, um, cycles, generosity might be something that really means something to you this week. 77. Is that? That's three readings in a row that 77 has come out. We've got the 33. 70, oh, seven, seven, seven. Angel number. If you look that up, you are going to get your own unique message. And so I would put that into my browser search. Um, Google that, as they say. There's another six. So 66. Yes, I think there's a lot of beauty, healing. Um, we've got Libra energy. So something fair. Something balancing out the scales. I also see the ascending number 67895, 67895. Four fives. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, look at that. So we are leveling up. This is a big, there's a lot of numbers. So this is a very big week. You might also find, um, of course, some addresses, phone numbers, something else, life path numbers in there. Uh, but yeah, Libra energy it means a fair turn is coming your way, I believe. And so with Gemini, we have more balance and beauty. Uh, maybe even love will be focused as that is the lover's card. I want you to go ahead and take a look at the letters. I see uh, quite a few uh, words you can make out of that. Maybe lending someone an ear this week will also be important to you. Let's get your yes or no answer ready. That is a really good lucky number. We, I, I'm not sure what that's going to mean for you, but I'm pretty excited. I also see like B and R are sticking out to me. I don't know what that means for someone, but that's, it seems like they're very important. Okay, so number three, your yes or no question for this week is answered with a no. It is a no for this week, number three. I hope that's a happy no. If not, remember that your future is in your hands. Okay, I'm going to move on to number four. Hello, number four. Let's go ahead and get your uh, sign symbols, initials, numbers, any kind of letters, anything that matters to us this week. Ooh, we have a ton. We have a ton of them, and this one seemed very important. So nine is about healing, um, kind of the approaching the end of a cycle. Uh, you're nearly there. You are almost there. We have a, the straight suit shooting Sagittarian energy and Gemini and Libra. Oh, and some Scorpio. So there might be some serious attraction going on this week uh, and transformation. We've got two and one. I feel like definitely something new, maybe a new partnership. MGT. That could be management. And yes, we have a Virgo, a Virgo as well. So maybe to call for some practicality, fairness, balance, honesty, determination. Okay, I am going to get your yes, no 
answer ready. So go ahead and pause the video if you want, make what you will of the letters and numbers, but to have your yes, no question ready. We're gonna find out right now for number four, is the answer yes or is the answer no? It is no this week. I hope that is a happy no, but remember that you can change your future. You are manifesting things according to this. You have the power to do so. Okay, and on to number five. Hello, choice number five. I'm gonna go ahead and pull some charms for you and we're gonna see your signs, symbols, letters, numbers. What is important to you this week? Wow, that's a lot of importance. Um, the spirit. Spirit is very important to you this week. So if you have any spirituality that you practice, we want to see you uh, making sure you make time for that on a daily basis, ideally. Um, we have Piscean energy and strength showed up with Leo. So you are going to have the fortitude to make things happen this week and also the empathy and sincerity to be enjoying your life to the fullest. And we have quite a few letters, which is pretty exciting. And I'm seeing a ton of ones. There could be some fresh starts for people. We have a good foundation. Um, I think it's going to be a beautiful, happy week where a lot of stuff gets manifested. And you might even feel very much at home and balanced very balanced week. Maybe even start a new partnership. Okay, let's get your yes or no. Arizona could mean something to someone too. Let me know if you see anything in the letters. I'm not going to stay on them, but you can pause the video if you want and think of your yes, no question and make what you will of the letters. Okay, number five's yes, no answer for the week is yes. It is a yes this week. I hope that is a happy yes. Either way, you are creating your own future, so this answer can be changed by you and you alone. Okay? I hope you enjoyed this reading. If you do and you enjoy readings like this, please be sure to subscribe so you can catch my channel again. Uh, hit that bell to see my weekly notifications so you will see my video. Don't hesitate to get yourself a personal reading if you want. I have a 50% sale off if you use the code five zero off until next time have fun